Hi, I'm Rob at the Hay Needle Fulfillment Center in Monroe, Ohio. This is a short video on the assembly of the tripod easel. The estimated time on this assembly is around 15 minutes and there are no tools required. We'll start by opening our box and removing our pieces. When using a sharp object, always remember to cut away from yourself. Locate your instruction sheet. On the front you'll find a parts and hardware list. Take a brief inventory to make sure you have all the pieces needed for the assembly. Using our hardware labeled as F, our wing nut, bolt, and flat washer, we're going to attach our pieces A and B to two of our pieces C. First, start with your piece B and lay your pieces C on top, making sure the holes of B are in the inside. Next, take your piece A, lay on top of C, and using your hardware, place through A and into B. On the reverse side, take your flat washer, then your wing nut, and tighten into place. Repeat this with your second piece of hardware. Next we'll attach our two pieces D to our two pieces C. To do this, we'll be using our hardware labeled as H. Place your two pieces D, making sure the slanted end is facing towards the opposite. And using your hardware, place through C and into D twice on each side. Then take your flat washer, then your wing nut, and tighten into place. Repeat this for your second piece. After you tighten your bolts into place, again using your hardware H, the wing nut bolt and flat washer, we're going to assemble our pieces C and E. Place E on top of C, lining up the holes, and place your hardware through each hole. And on the opposite side, using again your flat washer first, then tightening with your wing nut. Now that we have our piece C and E assembled, we'll use our hardware labeled as G which is our wing nut, bolt, and flat washer to attach the rest of the easel to CE. Take your bolt and first going through your piece D, then through your piece E, and then through your remaining piece D. Tighten on the opposite side using your flat washer and your wing nut. Now we'll attach one end of our chain. You're just going to simply screw it into the back of your easel. Now we'll screw our second gold hook into the back of the easel. All that's left to do is connect your chain and your easel is finished. 